At the Humane Society of Utah, we get about 12,000 animals a year. We're actually able to save over 10,000 of those animals a year. Back when social media was just starting, we were trying to always still get pictures of the animals. It can be very hard when you're dealing with thousands of animals, so we made the decision that it was worth the investment to hire a staff photographer. My name is Guinevere Schuster, and I'm the social media coordinator and photographer at the Humane Society of Utah. I make a list of the dogs that need updated photos, and I pull a dog into the studio, take their photo, and then I'll put them back in their kennel and just kind of repeat that process until I get as many photos as I'm able to get done for the day. A lot of times when you view a dog in the shelter, they're really vying for someone's attention, so they're barking or they're noisy or they're jumping up on a kennel. And once you take that dog out, five, ten minutes later, that might not be the dog's personality at all. But if that's your first time you meet that dog, that might form your opinion in that first 10, 20 seconds. I want them to think that they know this animal or have a connection with it before they even get to the shelter. It might give them more time to see, like, well, I want to see what it looked like when they were in this photo, so I'm going to spend more time with it. Sometimes, an hour after we put an animal up, there's a line of people here to adopt them. It goes that fast through the community, and it it's just shows the amazing power of being able to, to show an image like that, a photo, and have so many people see the beauty behind that animal that they are getting in their cars and coming down here our adoption rate increased because people see those faces and it speaks to them in a way that just a normal little shoot isn't going to. We've seen the difference and it's amazing.